gather here today to witness and celebrate an act of deep love. Ben and Megan, in their devotion, respect, and love for each other, wish to unite in the bond of marriage and to dedicate themselves to each other's happiness and well-being as life mates and partners. Two women have gone through the process that we call mothering. They know the voyage Ben and Megan are getting ready to embark on and would like to share a little something with them. Ladies. Benediction of the Apaches. Now you will feel no rain, for each of you will be the shelter to the other. Now you will feel no cold, for each of you will be the warmth to the other. There will be no loneliness, for each of you will be the companion to the other. Now you two bodies, but there is only one life before you. Treat yourselves and each other with respect, and remind yourself often what brought you together. Give the highest priority to the tenderness, gentleness, and kindness that your connection deserves. When frustration, difficulty, and fear assail your relationship, as they threaten all relationship at one time or another, remember to focus on what is right between you. Not only the part which seems wrong. In this way, you can ride out the storms with clouds hide the face of the sun in your lives, remembering that even if you lose sight of it for a moment, the sun is still there. And if each of you takes responsibility for the quality of your life together, it will be marked by abundance and delight. May beauty surround you both on the journey ahead and through all the years. May happiness be your companion always. Now go to your dwelling place to enter into the days of your life together. And may your days be good and long upon this earth. Marriage is a commitment to life, the best that two people can find and bring out in each other. It offers opportunities for sharing and growth that no other relationship can equal. It is a physical and emotional joining of two souls that is promised for a lifetime. Within the circle of its love, marriage encompasses all of life's most important relationships. A wife and a husband are each other's best friend, confidant, lover, teacher, listener, and critic. Marriage is the beginning of a new life, a chance at a fulfilling long-term dreams, and an opportunity for great spiritual and personal growth. Marriage thrives and continues to live as a promise of a beautiful dream come true. As long as individuals are drawn together, marriage will be a natural unfolding of that relationship. Ben, Megan, each of you brings gifts to the other today. Gifts of hope and laughter, focus and seriousness of purpose, sensitivity and recognition of the beautiful and the profound. A strong and resilient marriage is not an escape from this world, but a con contribution to it. Benjamin and Megan, may you combine and strengthen your gifts to be offered as a distinct and beautiful gift to the world. And now you stand before this community of family and friends ready to acknowledge to the world, this is my beloved, the one with whom I choose to create the rest of my life with. This is not a lesson in remedial carpentry. <laughs> we all know that marriage is not an always a smooth ride. Marriage deepens and enriches every, as, every facet of life. Happiness is fuller. Memories are fresher. Commitment is stronger. Even anger is felt more strongly and passes away more quickly. Marriage understands and forgives the mistakes life is unable to avoid. It encourages and nurtures new life, new experiences, and new ways of expressing a love that is deeper than life. Megan and Ben have created a box into which they will place the tools. A bottle of wine from Megan's hometown, Morrow, Ohio, a copy of their vows, and letters to each other that they believe these things will be the things that they need to repair what went wrong, causing that first fight. <laughs> <laughs> Preemptive strike. <laughs>
choosing to allow the presence of another human being to enhance who you are. Your rings carry a potent double message. You are individuals and yet you belong. You are not alone. As you wear them through time, they will reflect not only who you are, but also the union you are making. The fact that throughout the rest of your lives, each of you will be imprinted by the other, yet as yourself remains. I, Benjamin, I, Benjamin, take you, Megan, take you, to be my lawfully wedded wife. Lawfully wedded wife. Take this ring as a token of my everlasting love. I, Megan, I, Megan, take you, Benjamin. To be my lawfully wedded husband. To be my lawfully wedded husband. Take take this ring as a token of my everlasting love. Take this ring as a token of my everlasting love. By the powers vested in me, I now pronounce you. <laughs> <laughs> strength of my love for you, but I am lucky enough to have the rest of our lives to show you. I promise that I will love you truly and deeply with every atom of my being. I promise that I will respect, support, and admire you for who you are. I promise to guard you and to guide you through all of our struggles, and to learn, laugh, dance, and run with you in all of our adventures. I promise to grow old with you, but never to let us grow up completely. And I promise to keep updating my promises as we go. One set of vows cannot cover a lifetime of growing and changing with you, of having a family with you, and falling more and more in love with you each day. Thank you for being my happiness, my inspiration, and my companion. I will always love you forever and a day. <laughs> You asked me recently if, when we met, it was love at first sight, and I said no. <laughs> Attraction, yes, but, but love, our love is not something that just happened or something we rushed into. We built our love steadily over the years from the ground up. As we have taken new steps in our lives and grown as individuals, our love has grown and matured with us. It has not only brought us joy in our moments together, but has given us strength in the times we've been apart. When we have faced challenges or hit rough patches, our love brought us through them together, stronger than before. So I promise to keep building on the foundation of love we've already laid, and I promise to keep adding to the wonderful memories we've already made. I promise to help you hone your battle skills, and I will mix all the pizza dough. And I promise to be there to support you whenever you're feeling low. I promise to strive to be a good man and a good husband in every way. And most of all, I promise to love and honor you through good times and bad, in sickness and in health, forever and a day. <laughs> By the powers vested in me, I now pronounce you man and wife. <laughs>
It is my distinct honor to be the very first person to introduce you to Mr. and Mrs. Benjamin Manker. Woo! 